What's up guys? Thanks for tuning in. My name is Tyler and this is my little travel buddy Bentley. He and I live full time out of our converted Ford E350 van and we just set out on a six week trip to visit friends and family throughout Arizona, California, Utah, and Idaho. It's been a dream of mine for the last few years to travel full time and live out of my Jeep and Overland trailer. However, one day out on a trail in Colorado with some of my friends, the transfer case and transmission decided that they just didn't want to work anymore. It would have been a complete nightmare if it weren't for them. Thanks to them, Bentley and I made it out of there safe and sound, but the Jeep, well, not so much. It was just dead weight. You can see Shane and Steve daisy chain towing me out of that gulch. And seven weeks later, after it was fixed, I guess you can say, it never ran the same. And I was seriously questioning the reliability for full-time travel, especially pulling a trailer, plus some convenience factors as well. Well, I sold the Jeep, I bought a van, and I built the van out. It's not completely done yet, but pretty darn close. Um, and I've been full-time in it since May, May 1st to be exact. Uh, we are in Raton, New Mexico right now. Just taking a little break. A little, a little Bentley boy is tired out. Tired from sitting, I guess, sitting in the car. It's been a hot drive uh, with the AC broken on that, on the van. So it's been uh, rolling with the windows down. So it's been loud and windy, but at least it's been pretty cool. My van life has only recently begun. And while some may say I'm still in the honeymoon stage, man, I love it. Sure, it's not super easy. There are some difficult parts, but if I just kept dreaming about van life and hadn't jumped on into it, I'd be on a couch probably watching TV and missing out on this beautiful view, this awesome New Mexico sunset. I don't know about you, but views like this just won't ever get old for me. Well, we made it to Albuquerque. We we're just pulling into Costco to get some fuel. I think we're gonna go try to find a little grassy area first. Uh, that way Bentley can get out and do his business. He's kind of been walking around, looking like he's needing to pee. So we're gonna go find a little grassy spot or as grassy as a spot we can find in New Mexico. It's a gallop tonight. We are posted up at a Walmart. We're about to get Bentley out, take him for a little walk. Oh, it is nice and cool tonight here. We're gonna make some dinner. There's a bunch of people sleeping in their cars. They all have their windows open, so I'm gonna try to be a little quiet. All right, should be good enough. Let's get some little dices here.
it is time for bed. I am exhausted, long day of driving. It's amazing how just sitting, staring at a road just wears you out like crazy. Alrighty, we'll see you guys in the morning. Well, good morning, or good afternoon. <laughs> it was nice driving at night. Uh, I'm still asleep, guys. My brain hasn't woken up yet. We need to go get an energy drink or something. That's step one. Let's do that. And then we'll finish the drive. We made it. We are in Nasa right now. We're heading, uh, heading down to Gilbert. We're gonna stop at the gym and take a shower. I am very much looking forward to that. Well, sorry guys. I got all caught up visiting friends and family in Arizona. Plus, you know, dying in the heat. I didn't even think about filming anything. It was fun hanging out for a couple days, and since it was so hot there, I wanted to drive through the night out to my parents' place in California. I didn't film any of that either, but there was nothing to see anyway. If you made it to this point, wow, thanks, because I'm still figuring this stuff out. But hey, you gotta start somewhere, right? I'm gonna be helping my parents with some projects around their house and doing some more work on my van while we're here. I'm looking forward to it for sure. Thanks again for watching, and make sure you like, subscribe, and more importantly, comment to let me know what you think or what you'd like to see from us. All right, y'all, till next time.